four years is an eternity in Brockton as far as Super Bowls. Yeah, how much did you guys hear it from the townspeople the last couple of years? And how, how sick and tired of, were you, you guys? Uh, beyond sick and tired. <laughs> we were disgusted with it, especially last year. And I just want to thank the Lord and Jesus for this, uh, giving us this opportunity to come to Smack Weymouth. Yeah. You know, we really wanted to just nail them in the dirt. And, you know, they thought they were going to be good. They were a tough challenge, but, yeah. you know, we, uh, we're playing our best ball right now. Yeah. And so, uh, we were, like I said, we were disgusted, absolutely disgusted with uh, not being in the playoffs the last two years. So, you know, we really just want to turn the ship around and get this going. One more game. Obviously, the option, uh, the way you guys run that out of the flex, it's, it's a unique package for a lot of teams. But uh, the edge was, was uh, something you had a lot today um, as they packed it in. Talk about that, just how key that was. Um, you know, we got almost 10 yards of pop every time we got outside. Mm -hmm. And uh, that really set up, once, once you get, uh, have them flowing outside, it really sets up. In the, up the middle, and we broke a couple long ones up the middle. So if we can get to the edge, then I don't, I don't know anybody who could stop us. As far as Augie, you know, running the triple option, the veer, uh, all those plays, and knowing when to keep and when when to pitch, uh, where does this game rank as far as his most efficient games on the year? Um, very efficient. Um, you know, I'm not going to criticize him too much. He had yeah. a fumble earlier, yeah. but you know that was, that was a messed up blocking scheme somewhere. But uh, you know, we'll fix that. But uh, he was very very proficient. Made great decisions tonight. Yeah, just played Augie Ball. <laughs> it was great. And now this isn't the first time you've seen a spread team, but uh, what Harrison's a pretty unique figure. Yeah. O'Brien, Ozzie Colarusso, there's a number of uh, athletic targets there. What were the stuff you guys thought you could exploit against uh, you know, not only the passing attack, but just the way Harrison can extend the plays as well? If we eliminated Harrison from extending the plays, we knew we had a good shot. Um, you know, we've been playing great lockdown defense on the outside with our corners and our secondary the, you know, the past few weeks. And we know that if we could contain Harrison, then we have a good shot at winning this game. What do you what did you do to contain? Uh, pressure <laughs> up front and linebackers took the key steps, you know, stay in the cutback lanes and just uh, made sure that he wasn't going to get anywhere. And how about the angles you took back there? Uh, yeah, you, you had a nice stick there on Ozzy, but uh, yeah, just, uh, <laughs> I, was, uh, I was waiting for that. <laughs> you know, they were talking a lot during the game. You know, so so yeah. were we. It's the playoffs, yeah. and it was finally just to get that good hit. And I, I turned around, see him on the ground. You know. I'm not the one to boast about you know, hurting someone, but it was, it was a good hit, and you know, I get excited about it. So, cool.